The Lewis and Porter School District is cracking down on electronic cigarettes with a new policy. And that policy just went into place this month. News Force Chris Hervatitz went to Lewiston today to find out what's different there and whether or not it's working. Chris? Well, Jackie, Lewport is just like about every other school district in western New York. Students are bringing e cigarette devices into school and using them, sometimes even right there in class. That new policy, the high school principal says, it's cutting down on the problem. Newport High School principal Jake Taft has quite the collection of e-cigarettes, but they're not his. These are samples of vaping devices and materials that we've conf confiscated from students here at school. Either they were found to be in possession of or in the act of using them. This is just a fraction of what school officials in Newport have collected just this month, but it's still fewer devices than before the policy went into effect. Before this month, if a student was found with e-cigs, discipline would be discretionary. Now, the first time a student is caught, it's an automatic three-day suspension. The second time, a five-day suspension, both out of school. And this is new, too. The district keeps any devices school officials collect. They used to be turned back over to parents. We recognize that it is property and there is a dollar value attached to that. Um, but I think on the flip side, I think any reasonable person would say, you know what, my, my child's health and well-being far exceeds any dollar value on that. The new policy, Taft says, it's working. He thinks students are beginning to respect the new rules, causing a drop in confiscations. The first week, we, we had quite a few like kids that really weren't sure if we were going to implement what the information our superintendent put out to homes. And then, you know, that first week, we, we had some students experience the, the new policy. And tonight, they'll double down by hosting an informational meeting for parents. It's not so much about the punishment tonight. It's about putting the information in the hands of the parents so they can continue the conversations that we're trying to have here at the school level. That meeting is taking place at Lewport High School tonight. It's in the auditorium and starts at 6.30, so about 25 minutes from now. And Taft wants parents to be able to identify when their children are using these devices and take them out of their hands. Chris Arvada, it's News 4.